you know, Andy is really something, man. I mean, this is this little guy. He, he's not so little anymore, but he was little. I'm about this close to yeah, snapping. I know. <laughs> <laughs> this close to getting no. Um, but uh, I, I, I feel like not to digress, but I feel like Will Forte could almost say anything. Oh, he's great, and he's so funny. Mm -hmm. You know, just like Will Ferrell. So many Wills. You know, I know. Wilford Brimley. It's another. I'm kidding. No, he was a very serious actor. Nobody <laughs> yeah, knows know. him. He was William Defoe. William Defoe. He can Super be funny. funny. He was funny in that that vampire movie he did. That was yeah. funny. Anyway, but I feel like Andy was born, you know, and then Andy was just mm -hmm. William Defoe. He was no, that was John Malkovich. No, all right. Oh boy, keep talking. Here we go. Keep talking. It I'll take it. Over. It actually was William Defoe. Yes. Oh, so mm. ah, daylight come mm. and me wanna go home. Actually, I don't know. Oh, Mr. Tallyman, telly me banana. Oh, so daylight John Malkovich come was the we wanna go home. John Malkovich was the Filmmaker, yes. Willem Dafoe was, was the vampire. Yes. yes, and yeah, it was a funny movie. What was it called? Oh, uh, I don't remember. Perfect book of sh uh, no, that's no, not book of shadows. That's, that's, that's funny. Depp with the that's no. Oh, anyway, oh. the point is, Andy comes along, right? Yeah. You and I had this great thing going. I know, right? We were playing. Uh, we were, we were playing in the front yard with hoses. Mm -hmm. We, we were doing go karts. Go karts. Great things. Yeah. GI Shadow Joe. of a Vampire. Shadow of a Vampire. Didn't yeah. I say Shadow? Oh, no, you should, shadow, book, you of book of Shadows. It's a different movie. But. That's a uh, Book of Shadows is the um, is the uh, Robert Downey Jr. Uh, um, uh, really? Sherlock Holmes the sequel. Oh. Book of Shadows. Um, oh, great. Yeah. Uh, like but it. anyway, um, Book of Shadows is also Blair Witch too. Oh, did they name that Book of Shadows? A really? lot of shadows. Out a lot there, of guys. shadows. Yeah, mm. me and my shadow. Uh, anyway, um, but uh, and and then and then Andy comes along, right? You remember that? We yeah. thought we were getting a dog. Yeah, we thought we were gonna dog. And then Andy comes along. You know, you told the story the other day, but it had a lot more pizzazz. When yeah, you told I'm bored. It in the parking lot. Did I? Did I tell it in the parking lot? At TJ Maxx when we were trying to buy that uranium. Oh yeah, uranium. That's an inside joke. Oh, and boy. Then Matt was trying to tell us about <laughs> oh, this story, boy. and literally, he was saying he was in a mall parking lot, and there was the, the, he saw somebody selling uranium, and there was a DeLorean. No, I and did we were not. Like, Listen, a DeLorean. That is a, <laughs> a minivan that is, pulled up. Right, a minivan pulled That's up with a with an RPG, sure. and there was a guy in a sleeveless puffy vest, and we're like, Matt, that is Back to the Future. He's like. No, it wasn't. I saw it. It was at Pine that Crest Mall. That was my Mall. Thursday night right. at Pine like, Crest Mall. Yeah. No, yeah. it wasn't. Let me no, guess. What? You needed to get it up above 72 miles an hour? It's 88, but yes. Okay. Okay? Maybe 72. See, he's changing it. I know. He's trying to just tweak a little. Just enough. So we don't say that's back to the future. No, it was 72. <laughs> see? Not 88. Matt, <laughs> you just changed that. Just oh, is it 72 gigawatts? Is that what it was? No, no. 1.21 gigawatts. gigawatts. Oh, that is what it was. 1.21 yeah. gigawatts. Flux capacitor. Wait. Doc, are you telling me this thing's nuclear? Precisely, Marty. Mm -hmm. Oh, such a great movie. Um, right. But anyway, so then Andy comes along and yeah. changes everything. Really, he did. changes everything with his with his attitude. Yeah. Our parents took us out to dinner. We thought we were getting a dog. We had been waiting for a dog, and they said we're getting a baby brother. And we literally were like, "No, screaming no, <laughs> we're really, we're like, no, why? It's so good just the two of us." I know. And he came along, and somehow he made it better. But it took a while. Yeah. No, it was great. Remember, we 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 didn't put him down. No. Remember that? He didn't walk. He never walked. He, he still doesn't walk. We have to carry him. Yeah, he didn't develop that. legs. Yep. That's why in the pilot of Brotherly Love, he was he was Elvis. He yep. had to do the Elvis thing because Matt, I need to go to the restroom. Oh my god. Yes. Pretty much. Here's the deal. He was potty trained yes. at like nine months. But you had yeah, to walk him there. I, you know what's funny is I asked I asked mom about that. I was like, what when was I potty trained? And she goes, You kind I didn't potty train you. You right. just copied your brothers. Right. Mm -hmm. You did. You did. With everything. Right. So thanks, guys. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Thanks to you, I know how to pee and poo in the toilet. Yeah. And you do a darn good job at it, buddy. Because we only teach the best methods. The best. <laughs> we do nothing but the best. All right. You see this right here? Yeah. This is what you do. This is a clean stream. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this is how you do it, okay? I feel like Sebastian, right? Maniscalco or yeah. whatever. Oh, my God. Aren't you embarrassed? Aren't you embarrassed by that stream? My favorite um, thing that he says, because it's so true. He's like, um, I, I don't know if his wife is Jewish or if he was dating a Jewish girl at the time, okay. but he was going over Jewish family. You know, Jewish and Italians, they're, they're kind of so similar, similar, right? Family, guilt, it's all the same. He said the only thing that's different is that when you sit down at the table, yeah. it, Italians, you know, like, and the way he does, he's like, I gotta do something. Like, where's the bread and the olive oil? I gotta eat. I gotta do something with my hand, you know. Right, and he's right. very, he's very right. And, and they start handing out pamphlets. And <laughs> he was like, "We're supposed to start reading." He was like, "Where's the pasta?" He was like, "So he said a funny line." He That's was funny. like, "So it's I'll do funny. this." It's funny. I think we should it's allow funny. the Jewish community to 
uh, arrange the event, but we get the Italians to cook the food and the catering. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. It's funny. Yeah. That's funny. What am I going to do with it? Reading? Yeah, you're like, reading? I wanted sauce. Yeah. Uh, no, it's great. So, so then Andy comes along and he... Uh, he, he changes everything up. Yeah, oh, drastically. Have we ever said, we ever told the story about him bouncing and that the bouncer thing? I don't know. Oh my God. Andy, so, so cute. look, we were all very busy. Yeah. And Andy comes along and he needs to be obviously. Did you forget about taking, me? Or no, it could no. Be hardly. But you were. Because we carried you around for so long, you weren't walking, but you were doing everything else. Talking. Everything. Oh, making jokes. Making jokes. Planning. Planning. Directing, but you couldn't. Estate walk. planning. So. <laughs> balancing checkbooks. What? So mom was like. Laundry. <laughs> Mom got you this jumper thing that we would attach to the middle of the. It, it had two uh, door things. frames, yeah. and we had this big, like, like opening, double door. Right. Yeah. It was to the den that became yes. my room after Same we stopped bedroom. sharing at sixteen. That's right. Even though I was doing very well, I was sharing a bedroom with you till I was seventeen. That's, that's crazy. Totally isn't it? true. All we were, through all that time, how crazy is that? Yeah. Blossom and everything. Joe's time. Joe and I were sharing bunk beds. Yes. <laughs> I was the most famous 16 year old in the world and I was sharing a bunk bed with my brother. But you know what? I wouldn't trade it for the world, no, bro. That was great, dude. I wouldn't trade it for the world. So then Andy awesome. comes along and we put him in this, they had these two like stirrup things mm -hmm. and this bouncy and it was on cables, suspension cables. Yep. To work his thighs yeah. out so he could walk. It's why to this day he has he legs still has three massive, times. Yes. yes. People nice comment legs. about his legs. It's true. In our, in, our, in our videos when Andy jumped up on top of your truck and everyone was like, look at those legs. Mm. Now, of course, he had to add a growl in for himself because, you know, he had to make it larger than life. It's true. But uh, so we're putting him in this thing, right? In this bouncy thing. And, and remember, mom mom was like, you know what? We're just going to see if he likes it because mm. it'll be great to keep him occupied because he's yeah. so active and we got a lot of stuff going on. And he started bouncing. And when and I bouncing. say he bounced. And, and bouncing. And bouncing. And bouncing. Yes. All right. I bounce for a lot. And we get I it. remember walking by. Let's... I'd wake up. I'd go into breakfast. I'd come back. I'd wake <laughs> Yeah. I would I would make four or five trips past that hallway, and Andy would just be happy. It was the same thing every time. Bouncing. He'd have something like yes, yes. We come by, we give him a little treat. He would come by. You remember <laughs> that dog? You kind, kind of. of. Yeah, we, we we always wanted one, so yeah. you were kind of. You treat, we treated you like our puppy. At we first. did. We I wore did. a collar until we I was did. three or four we did. years old. But that was because we didn't want to lose you. With a bell, <laughs> with a bell on it. Yeah, we had. We did put bells. We did put a bell on. Yeah, we had really. Bell. Oh, I think I had the bell. You I had, had bells. Bell. In your I was feet. sneaky. You were really yeah, sneaky. I was sneaky. Mom put bells in your shoes. Yeah, so she we had knew where you were. Because Matt would just. No way. I would sneak away. Bells in his shoes. Yep. Yeah, I would sneak away on the tips. Because Matt. And also, I would. I would. I love the outdoors. No, no, God, it got scary. I would sneak outside and walk away outside. Yeah, just around the yards, like a like a year old yeah two i would sneak two. out and two Bing. so all right so, let's talk more about me okay back no, i'm just to kidding you. i'm just kidding wait that's kind of cute bells it is on the cute. shoes yeah, yeah that bells, bells on, shoes. on my shoes it really is cool it really is <laughs> it's so yeah i would sneak out everywhere <laughs> he, i remember <laughs> ding 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 yeah, maddie it's cute yeah come back here i do remember yep bells, he would just yeah. but andy came along and he was bouncing away like crazy and uh i remember like you said matt we carried him everywhere, everywhere. you and i carried him everywhere. everywhere he really was our puppy yeah he was until eventually mom was like guys you have to put him down and mm -hmm. the crazy thing is he walked so quickly after that so remember that quick. like he knew how to walk sudden, yeah he was yeah. up walking yeah was like it. you knew how to walk it's just yeah. we weren't letting you i don't walk. really remember this you don't well, yeah. i mean very you, probably vague, like vaguely. not even two yeah, you were like a year. I have and very vague year memories. Year and a half. Yeah. Maybe a year. And maybe. Do you remember that the living room set up at, at Hesby Street? Oh, I remember all of Hesby Street. Yeah. Do you? Yeah. That was, so Hesby Street, we, that's, a, that's a place where we first settled here on the West Coast. Yes. Settled here in this country. Yes. We came out in a covered wagon. Oh, God. Oh, God. Seven horses and arrived with four. Back then, we didn't have things like running water. Or electricity. That's right. Mm. We had 13 family members. Oh, my. Showed it, up with five. We had to eat them to survive. But then this oh, train God showed up. Hell. Then this train showed up. Then I got into a fight with a cannibal prostitute. Oh it's all. Oh, up the sham wow no. store. You're making it up. Wait a minute. Stop it, Joe. And then I was and trying to story. buy uranium in TJ Maxx. No, oh, I was, I was going to no. say. No, yeah. then this weird covered sports car showed up and brought with it a man in white hair and a trench coat. Is this Back to the Future? Was part it a DeLorean? Three? It was a De right. Well, how did you know, <laughs> guys? This is back we hid it in a barn, and then he got into a gunfight, and he put this piece of steel. Oh, Wait a minute, this God. is Back to the Future three. And at the end, a locomotive train traveled through time <laughs> and brought us here. It's Back to the Future three, and isn't it? They're friends. Right. Thank you so much for watching this clip of the Broadly Love Podcast. And for exclusive weekly bonus content, join our Patreon right now. That's right. There's a link in the description for that, too. Thanks so much for tuning in. Thank you. Thanks.